Not all babies are cute. Hey ladies, it is Wednesday and it is Jess, and this week we have a really fun topic. We are going to be talking about our unpopular opinions. And as I was like writing my list of unpopular opinions, um, at first I was like, this is really hard because I just think all of my opinions are spot on. But as I kept writing, I have come to the conclusion that um, a lot of my opinions are very controversial. Um, so I want to hear you guys' thoughts after I list them all about what you guys think. Um, but my first one is helpful sales staff. I know, I know, I know, I know that you guys are maybe trained to be helpful to ask your customers questions. Some of you just might be a personality trait that you guys have. I find it infuriating and so annoying when sales staff constantly come up to you and say, hi, how are you? What can I help you with? Are you doing okay? How are you? Can I help you with anything? It's like being constantly bombarded by people and questions. I just want to shop. I don't want to be pestered. I would like you guys to stand at the edge of the room um, and then be available when I need you, but not to come to me. Let me come to you. Um, I feel pretty strongly about that. You don't have to shower every day. Um, I know that many of you are thinking, gross, but you really don't. Research shows that you don't have to shower once a day. In fact, you shouldn't shower once a day because it's actually bad for you. You get rid of the good bacteria. Uh, it's bad for your hair, it dries out your skin, it's not good. You're not supposed to shower every day, um, but I, I guarantee you, you guys would disagree with that, um, or a lot of you will, but you don't have to. I think that abortion should be a thing, as should gay marriage. I don't know if this is unpopular or not, but I think that there should be a national, nationwide, compulsory, man mandatory, Mandatory national high school class on feminism, gender, and sexuality. I think it's absolutely crucial and wild that we don't do that. I think we should have freeways in America, like the Autobahn in Germany, where you can basically drive at whatever speed you want. And short of that happening, I think that all the speed limits on freeways and highways in America should be at minimum 75, but probably 80, honestly, but minimum 75. The ideal temperature for any room is 60 to 65 degrees Fahrenheit, even if it's winter. Sephora is the most overwhelming store on the planet, and I hate every second of my life when I'm in there. I do like some of Avril Lavigne's songs, and it might be the angsty teenager within me, but some of her songs are okay, and I don't want to be persecuted or judged for that because everyone has their guilty pleasures, right? Stephen Colbert is hands down better than Jon Stewart, and I really can't listen to any arguments that contradict that. I didn't like visiting Italy. I had a horrible, horrible experience there. The food was horrendous, which is bizarre for Italy, but the food was gross, and the locals were nasty to me in my group. Um, so I would do it again, I would give it another chance, but I really did not like my visit to Italy. It was really bad. I'm not big on alcohol. Um, as a 22 year old, that seems strange, but I hate tequila, um, which means no margaritas. I hate wine, which means being a social outcast. And I really only tolerate, barely tolerate beer, which means I can't hang with the hipster crowd. Uh, I do like rum and I love a good mojito. Sushi is disgusting. Coffee is disgusting. I love rainy, cloudy weather. It perversely makes me happy, uh, and I don't like the beach or the ocean. I'm not about to go dump waste in the ocean or oil or something, but I just don't like being in it. I see it as a giant toilet for the ocean, which it basically is. Kay is going to hate me for this, but Bunnies are the most overrated pets because once you actually have a bunny, you realize the reality of the situation. Sure, they're cute, but um, you constantly have to clean their cage, which smells disgusting. They chew up everything in your house, and every time they take a step out of their cage, they leave little droplets of poop everywhere. Plus, I get really freaked out when I hold bunnies because you can feel their hearts beating so fast that I constantly think they're on the verge of having a heart attack. It is so stressful owning bunnies. 
I think that you have a social obligation to vaccinate your children. And if you don't vaccinate your children, I think that you should be quarantined from society off in the woods somewhere, if that's what you choose to do. But you should not be in society. Leggings can be worn as pants. Diet Coke is uh, way better than regular Coke, and regular Coke tastes like diarrhea mixed with sugar, and I think that I can actually feel myself getting diabetes as I drink a regular Coke. I don't know if Bigfoot is real, but he might be. I think that the US would be much better off following Canada's gun policy. Soccer is the most fun sport to both play and to watch, which I don't think many Americans would agree with. Women wearing makeup to me translates to women painting their face to make themselves pretty, um, which is both weird and like kind of cool, but also like a disturbing social convention to me. Social Republicans scare me. Capitalism as a political and economic system is inherently flawed. White people who co-opt Black Lives Matter to All Lives Matter are well-intentioned, but completely missing the point. So, I'm sure I have more, but that's the list that I came up with of my unpopular opinions. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about them. Do you agree or disagree? Tell me why. Uh, also, what are your unpopular opinions? I want to know those as well. Um, leave them down in the comments below, as well as topics for next week if you're so inclined. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying whatever it is that you are doing. Um, but I will see you next Wednesday. Bye, guys.